Traveling with your cat or your kitty by plane can be nerve wracking for some, but I'm going to break it down step by step and make it super easy. With the travel carrier, each airline will have their specific requirements um, for what will fit under their seats. So you'll wanna look on their website, the website of the airline, to make sure that your carrier is approved. Um, I also recommend a soft-sided carrier, so that way it can mold a little bit underneath the seat and bend. And then of course, line it with a puppy pad. You can leave the carrier out so the cat can get used to having the carrier around. You can also practice quick trips with your cat, maybe to the store or down the street, around the corner in the car so they get used to being in the carrier. You can also include a little toy, something that will keep them not only occupied but has their scent on it to keep them calm. Here's another tip. Most people put their cats in head first. I recommend putting them in tail first. It goes a lot smoother. So not only do I have a puppy pad in the carrier, I also carry an extra one with me in the little to-go bag, um, as well as a poop bag, just in case there's an accident, and some hand wipes, hand sanitizing, antibacterial wipes. You'll wanna have those on hand, just in case you need to quickly change out the dirty, soiled pad on the airplane. Thankfully, it hasn't happened yet, but you never know. Make sure to check with your airline prior to travel to make sure that you have the medical paperwork necessary for the flight. Um, you'll need current medical certificates to come with you from your vet. And of course you'll have food. I have two little disposable water and food bowl and then their favorite treats. These guys like dehydrated salmon um, just to keep them comfortable on their trip and have food ready for their destination. Here's another tip. You know how your cat likes to jump in the litter box right when you're trying to scoop? Well, scoop right before you leave for the airport and you'll get the cat to use the restroom. When you reach TSA at the airport, you can ask them for a private screening room. So that way you don't have to pull your kitty out of the carrier in public. I pack a small disposable litter box in the event of a long layover or unexpected delay. You can find a private family restroom in the airport to let the kitty out of the carrier to use the litter box or eat and drink. I made sure to get a seat by the bathroom. Off we go to our destination. Show us some love by liking this video and subscribing to our YouTube channel.